My name's Dylan and I'm, I've come here every couple of months. I have a muscle wasting disease, so life threatening, so you just have to just be a bit more careful. Yeah, I'm all, all fine. That, it's just my legs that don't work, but everything else works. Dylan came here, it, he came to Helen House first of all, as quite a, young, a lonely young man. He didn't have a group of friends and he's come here and he has flourished. He has, he has made new friends, he's made the transition from Helen House to Douglas House. He is a young adult and he is living his life to the full. My favourite thing is just to be with my mates. feels like I have more independence with my because you can do, go to bed whenever you want and you can really do all sorts of things. I can go out into Oxford and go to like the cinema with my mates and just sometimes just chill out together and watch TV or playing games. Helen and Douglas House is a hospice for children and young adults and that sounds really sad but it's not. So when I first went and arrived here at Helen Douglas House um, there was a sense of fear. Um, I've got four children, I'm coming into a children's hospice. But you don't get that. There is a feeling of happiness. What we do here is try and enable people to have the best time they can with the life they have. We provide support, friendship and quite technical care at, at times um, to children and young adults who have life shortening conditions. Dollar UK employees um, give up a lot of their time for the charity because they feel an emotional attachment to it. Um, I'm very proud of them and they don't have to give up their time but um, I think they get a lot back from it emotionally, spiritually. The most important part of fundraising is have sustainable giving which we can plan for. So things like direct debits, things like payroll giving, every pound is important to us but if we know that pound is coming we can actually spend it more efficiently. Some of the things they've been doing, Halloween cake bake, then there was the um, sports day. I think um, a lot of people participated in that, run the cakes off, that's great. My CIO came and asked me if he could um, cycle to Poland with him and the team. Oh, we're going to put stationary bikes in. That's an awful lot of miles. I think they raised over 9,000 pounds. As well as all the charity, a lot of people do payroll giving. Um, I for one do that and encourage staff and new joiners. In aggregate, charity events, payroll giving, contributions that the firm has made, it's over half a million pounds. The community at Helen Douglas House is unbelievable. It's not just the child or the adult, young, young person, um, it's the whole family they take care of. My mum and dad can have a bit of a rest and have time on their own together because I'm always at home with them. Yeah, because we live together. You can phone at any time if you're struggling with anything. There's always someone to talk to. Um, and they've been really, really amazing. I don't really know what we would have done without them and what other families would have done. Bye. Bye. On behalf of Helen and Douglas House, I'd like to say a massive thank you to all the staff at Dolly UK for all you do, whether it be the cycle ride to Poland, whether it be the bake-off, whether it be payroll giving. Thank you so much. I'd like to personally thank all the past and present employees who have done so much in terms of giving up time and giving their money to this wonderful partnership that we have with Helen Douglas House. Thank you all.